EA Sports. It's in the game. Hi, I'm Tom Rennie. Welcome to Training Camp, a new feature brought to you by EA Sports NHL and Hockey Canada to deliver tips and tricks that will help you improve your hockey skills. We want you to enjoy the game as much as we do, and it's always more fun when you're learning and improving. So take advantage of these tips to learn the rules, build your hockey knowledge, and you'll see the results in your game wherever you choose to play hockey. Good luck and have fun. Hi, this is Ray Ferraro. In conjunction with Hockey Canada, I'm going to teach you both the sport of hockey and how to perform the actions in the game that will help you be more effective. There's six key parts to training camp. Shooting, passing, defense, face-offs, basic deking, and advanced deking. If you're new, you'll probably want to learn the basics of the first four training categories. If you're an advanced user, you can jump ahead to advanced deking if you want. After the interactive training camp, there's a whole suite of videos covering the concepts that are taught to the players at Hockey Canada. Then as you play and enjoy the game, keep an eye out for Hockey Canada videos that the coaching feedback system recommends to you. Those are based on your personal performance. Let's get it going. Hey everybody, in shooting training camp, we're going to teach you different kinds of shots and how to use these shots to effectively score goals. Using the NHL skill stick controls, the left stick always controls your player and the right stick controls your hockey stick. To take a basic shot, just press the right stick forward. The control hint is there to remind you what to do. The best time to shoot is always when the hint darkens. Let's hit the ice. You can try this for yourself. The slap shot's the most powerful shot in hockey. It's your best chance of scoring if you're far from the net. To wind up for a slap shot using skill stick controls, you pull the right stick back, and then to shoot, you press the right stick forward. You can't wind up for too long or the puck's gonna sail away on you. Now try it now.
Since the right stick controls your hockey stick, you can use it to position the puck around your body. Okay, to prepare for a wrist shot, first you hold the puck out to your forehand side, which for a left shooting player is out to the left. This will cause you to enter into a glide. This will improve your shot power and accuracy. When you're ready to take the wrist shot, press the right stick up. To have a better chance of beating the goalie, you have to aim your shots. Use the left stick to aim at an open spot. The shot lane visualization shows which side of the net is open, and the goalie grid visualization shows dark blue regions the goalie doesn't have covered. Before shooting, enter a forehand glide or a slap shot windup and look at the goalie. Use the left stick to aim at an open spot. When it turns green, you keep the left stick held, press the right stick up. Hey everybody, in shooting training camp, we're going to teach you different kinds of shots and how to use these shots to effectively score goals. Using the NHL skill stick controls, the left stick always controls your player and the right stick controls your hockey stick. To take a basic shot, just press the right stick forward.